As part of efforts to combat human trafficking, the state of Kuwait held an extensive meeting to tackle this phenomenon in the presence of the Minister of Justice and the Minister of Awqaf and Islamic Affairs, Dr. Mohammed al -Wasmi. That's uh, true and correct as well. Also, the meeting that was held at the Kuwait Institute for Judicial and Legal uh, Studies have uh, reviewed ways to combat and end the human trafficking in the country. Here's more with our reporter, Nasr al -Hussein. In this context, the National Permanent Committee for the Prevention of Human Trafficking and Smuggling of Migrants held an extensive meeting, chaired by the Minister of Justice and Minister of Awqaf and Islamic Affairs, Dr. Mohammed al Wasmi. Uh, we have a meeting today with the uh, Ambassador from the United States, Her Excellency Sydney, regarding uh, combating the uh, human trafficking and uh, what we have done in Kuwait so far and uh, what's the uh, procedures that Kuwait will take in the future to combat the uh, human trafficking uh, that's to uh, improve the image of Kuwait uh, in regard uh, the human trafficking. The meeting was attended by Assistant Minister of Foreign Affairs for Human Rights Affairs Ambassador Sheikha Jawahir Ibrahim al Sabah U.S. Ambassador at Large to Monitor and Combat Trafficking in Persons, Cindy Dyer, and representatives of relevant government entities. Actually, Kuwait has made a lot of achievement and effort in that regard. We have the law 91-2013 to combat the uh, phenomena of the uh, uh, human trafficking. Uh, in addition, we have the uh, National Permanent uh, committee, which is headed by the Minister of uh, Justice. Uh, the Ministry of Foreign Affairs is a member beside uh, the Ministry of Information, Ministry of Interior, Ministry of Health, and the General uh, Prosecutions and the uh, General Authority for Man uh, Power. During my visit here to Kuwait, I was so happy to be able to participate in a meeting with the commissioners for the Trafficking in Persons Commission. It was led by the Minister of Justice, and so I had the opportunity to talk with him. I also had an opportunity to talk to interagency leads from interior and public prosecution and hear about the interagency working group and also just to share ideas and um, creative solutions to solving the problem of trafficking in persons. Minister Wesmi affirmed that Kuwait is making significant efforts to reduce this phenomenon following the directives of the cabinet and through the full implementations of the national strategy and international agreements signed with the United Nations to promote human rights. In this meeting, there were discussions about Kuwait's pivotal role in combating human trafficking. This is Nasr al reporting for the News Department.